So a while ago I did a video on the varied carpet beetle, Anthrenus verbashi, which is a 3 millimeter long beetle. So you can find a lot of these in your houses or apartments. They basically seem to thrive on nothingness. Um, it's not a case of spontaneous generation. It's basically they're home pests and they eat anything organic. So they could live in a damp place uh, that's cold with no light or they could just live on your carpet and eat the fibers and I haven't found anything in the literature to suggest how these animals get their water so you know unlike silverfish that go to the bathroom to get water I've never seen these in the bathroom I've only seen adults go to sinks and stuff to get some water so I think these probably just eat carpet fibers and clothing and any other old organic matter lying around your home and basically hydrolyze it and produce some water metabolically. Um, they seem like the kind of creatures that are very resistant to uh, desiccation. But this is a clear case of something that looks like what it eats. So it has a lot of woolly hairs. It's kind of a elongate grub. It's not really a worm, but you know, it just resembles a very short and stout hairy caterpillar. Very carpet beetle larvae take one to three years to become adults, and they basically emerge between late May and early August, and they'll fly around and try to get to flowers to feed. The life expectancy of the beetle is only two weeks. Adult beetles usually lay their eggs in air ducts, in closets, under furniture, or under baseboards.